Time now for Ask the Expert. Today we are talking about what you should do if you find a stray animal. So joining us live this afternoon is Molly Greedling from the Wisconsin Humane Society. She's here with Bibi, who up uh, checking everything out. Yeah, she has been very social since she arrived. Bibi is eight years old. She's mm -hmm. already spayed, vaccinated, microchipped, and she is a social butterfly. And sporting a lovely sweater. Yeah, you can't see it. There's a lot of glitter on the other yeah, side. There is. <laughs> so. Um, so stray animals, uh, that we see them all the time. Yeah. What, what do we do? So, you know, anytime you see an animal outside, you might be questioning, is this a stray animal or is this somebody's animal that's running off leash? It's really important to just assume that any animal that you see outside that's running loose, that they might be a stray, just so you can start making the right steps. The most important tip that we have for people is to make sure that they aren't chasing after these animals. Oh. So most stray animals are already afraid, they're scared, they're lost. Yeah. Um, so you're going to want to make sure that you aren't running after them. Um, our other tips for you are to stay low to the ground, um, that way you'll appear less threatening. If you have any treats that you can bring out, that's really good to use as well. Um, and just have a lot of patience. It can take some time to course the animals back to you. You say a lot of patience, that's uh, some good advice there. But obviously you don't want to go chasing after the animal because yeah. it's probably going to run. Yeah. But if you try to coax them in, just you're saying get low and be patient. Yep, yep. You can like kneel on the ground yeah. and, you know, just kind of turn your body a little bit and just try to feeding them treats. Right. Um, if you do, or if you're able to get the animal or even if you're not able to get the animal, the next best step is to call your local stray holding facility. Okay. So if you live in Milwaukee County, that's going to be Matic. Right. Yep. Um, if you live in Ozaki or Racine County, that would be the Wisconsin Humane Society. And that way they can help you with those next steps to try to reunite that animal with their owner. All right, good to know. And thank you, Bibi, for coming to our place and checking out our place. She's loving it. All right.